in this video we are going to see how to make a animation type of scrollable texture for a 3d game object so like this we are going to see how to make so if you see the surface is moving and then object which we have that is also move we have a moving texture let's see let's now we can begin so i created a 3d cube and then uh, we are going to have a light for that so this 3d cube we are going to make as a ground plane okay so change the camera angle from orthographic to perspective so that it will be visible in the form of 3d okay so next create a folder so this is going to have a material so i'm going to create a material drag and drop the material to the game object then drag the particular texture to a material so that you can able to see that material has been applied to your game object now okay i'm trying to make some even kind of platform so that you can able to visible in in a camera okay i think is fine you can able we can able to visible that easily so let's create a script to make a scrollable texture drag and drop the script to the cube open the script we are going to have float scroll position x and then scroll y position so generally i am going to make x scrolling y scrolling so you can able to tweak at the editor which position you like to make a texture moving type of animation okay so make it as public then float updated exposition it's going to have time dot time multiplied by scroll expression okay and then updated y position it's going to multiply by time dot time scroll y position so once i got a updated the x and y position according to the input we given at the editor it's going to reflect in the editor okay so this got get component of render dot material dot main texture equal to we are going to have new vector to since we need a x and y i am going to apply in x and y updated x position and then updated y position so we got a one error let's check it out what error is that i believe it's due to yeah so material dot main texture offset okay so we are getting from the material dot main texture offset not a main texture okay now it's fine so let's check it out so just have some minimum value 
for x and y it's working fine but not exactly what we are looking for so the texture for pattern is will be ended once it's reach a uh, value one so we want to solve that problem let's see let's see how it's work exactly it's going keep on one two three but the texture pattern will be from zero to one nine right so in order to solve that you want to convert to texture type to wrap mode from clamp to repeat okay make sure that you need to have the mode should be in either repeat not a clamp so once you convert into texture it need to be in this format then you can able to see that repeated scrollable texture is showing up so everything is work fine let's try with some other game object so this is one more game object just think about this is a player so drag and drop the same script so i'm going trying to increase a little bit more uh, scrolling system i mean the input variable okay drag and drop the material yeah now it's fine so you can able to see this working with different speed and this working with different speed the base is working with different speed and then player is working with different speed so that is the thing so single script it's supporting in different animation system for a scrolling texture so that's it thank you